welcome to this video. Today we're going to learn how to schedule a meeting or a live class in Microsoft Teams. So, in the when you go into your team in the general posts area here, if you go down to the bottom where you can start typing in a message to the class, there's a few options down the bottom here. We're going to the fourth one over which is the one with the little camera on it. It says meet now so we're going to select that. Okay. And there's a pic there's my face so I'm going to switch that off because you don't want to be seeing me now I'm going to type in here what the, the class so I'm just going to call this a live lesson okay and instead of saying meet now I'm going to hit the schedule a meeting button there so now we have a much more detailed screen okay so I'm going to say when I'm going to schedule this lesson for so let's say for example I'm going to schedule this lesson for Monday and I'm going to set the time for say 9.45. Now you can see here there's no time for 9.45. So I'm going to put in 9.30 and I'm going to put in myself using my keyboard the time. So it says 9.45 until 10.30 say for example. So it's a 45 minute class. Okay. If I want I can set this to be repeating that it happens every day or every week. So if I'm going to have a live class every week at that time I can set it to that. Okay. Or whatever you want it to be set up with there. Okay, if I want to add in some details for the class to here, so I'm just some test information, I can get that, I can add that in there. Okay, I don't have to add anyone here. Okay, um, they will automatically find out, but if I want, I can add in the students' names there as well. And then I press send, and there we go. We can see ourselves that it's going to appear down here. In their, in their, on the main feed there. Now if I want them all to find out, I'm going to hit the reply there to make sure they get an email to find out. I'm going to write at team and I'll select the suggestion there. And I'm just going to press send, uh, enter or send on that. And that way they're all going to get a notification about this live lesson that I've set there. Also as well if you look in the calendar, you'll see yourself that that lesson is now appearing there. But for some reason, there we go, live lesson is set up there for them so they can see it there on their calendar. Hope this video is useful folks. If you have any questions please ask away in the comments below. If you enjoyed the video give it a like and subscribe to the channel. Thanks very much for watching. Bye now.